Students in the Austin area will get another chance at a successful career thanks to a new grant. American youth workers secured a million dollars from the U.S. Department of Labor. Kexan's Alex Capriello explains how to allow hundreds of students to land the jobs our city needs. I see a path for me. I know what I want to do in the future. 18-year-old Victoria Chisholm is a lot like other kids. I think I've always been creative. Confused and overwhelmed, Chisholm decided she was done with public school. I felt very uh, alone and isolated from everyone else. And within two weeks, I just wanted to go out. The walk through the halls at American Youth Works, where she attends the Youth Build program, and it seems like any other high school. This is our GED room, our second source of academics. But these students trade school books for skeletons, homework for hard hats, and grades for graphic design. They came for a second chance. They want to learn and they want to do better. Research shows one in five Texas high schoolers will drop out. The Youth Build program allows them back in, as well as those who have been homeless, dealt with mental health issues, or were incarcerated. A lot of them have given up on themselves and uh, come here not really expecting to be successful. And we really try to flip that script. 75 to 80 percent of youth build grads will go on to higher education or a job in the Austin economy. All focused on the same plan, all trying to move uh, local low income families to connect with the opportunities that are here in Austin. So students just like Chisholm can shape the future landscape of our city. When you want to do better, um, sometimes the door can be slammed in your face. So I think it's important for students to get a second chance. In Austin, Alex Capriello, KXAN News. Each student in the Youth Build program has the option to focus their trajectory on careers in construction, computer technology, or healthcare. Members earn a stipend while enrolled and have access to college credits and national industry recognized certificates. Chisholm, by the way, will earn her high school degree at the end of the month. And the grant for American Youth Works is part of an $85 million uh, grant awarded to youth built programs in 32 states. All of the grants range from about $700,000 to more than a million. The only other organization in Texas that's getting the money besides this one is Community Development Corporation of Brownsville. There's